Hello guys and welcome to White Noise Gaming and today I have something a little bit different for you. As you can see, I am playing Legend of Zelda, but it is fully rendered in Unreal Engine 4, I believe. So, I've already explored this a little bit. There's not too much to do. They said fully playable on a gaming website and I saw this and I'm like, man, I just had to download that. Fully playable must mean full level, but mostly just walking around but when you look at it it is really cool so so the stuff we can do basically is if I press space while I'm walking I get to do a barrel roll and if I have my sword out I can swipe and if I'm walking and press B I can do this upward tap I can also put away Navi take Navi out and every time I take him out he says hey listen Wow, <laughs> not really turn of the age stuff, but let's, let's go, let's go explore a little more. All right, so there's nothing in this room here that you can do, but guys, what I really wanted to say is just, just take a little bit and look at this, just appreciate all of it just take it in absorb it do what you have to do but this was made by one guy at least one YouTube channel and I know personally as a Legend of Zelda fan we wouldn't mind having the new Legend of Zelda being like this we wouldn't mind any Nintendo games being like this I have seen this guy do some crazy things I've seen him do Pokemon I don't know if he's the one that did uh, the golden eye maps he redid a golden eye map in in uh unreal engine but this takes a lot less time considerably like considerably less time for one guy to do this than it does a whole company to do this so what i'm thinking is maybe unreal engine is the future of gaming that's what i'm thinking i mean just the way it's physics work and how everything forms together is really nice. So, this is a prime example. I mean, look how everything was rendered and put into here. There was countless hours of man work put into this. But still, I'm guaranteeing that it's less work than what a whole company would do. Because there's so many communication issues and errors that you have to go through at a company for a video game to be produced. Everything here is complete. So, guys, is Unreal Engine 4 the future of gaming? Let me know in the comments. Leave a comment on what you think. Please like this video if you liked it. No, just liked it if you didn't. This, if you like, didn't like it, but that'll make me cry, guys. I'm just kidding. It won't, it won't make me cry, but it it might make me consider YouTube. No, it won't make me consider YouTube either, but there are those people out there that do not like videos like this that are informative. I don't know why, but there is people out there. Seriously, if you look at this guy's YouTube, this guy even has dislikes on this video. It's like, what kind of person would dislike this? I'm a Nintendo fanboy, and I feel like that this is really just way out there and not anything reminiscent of Nintendo. I think this guy does a bad job. Don't be one of those guys, people. Just, just please don't be one of those guys. As always, guys, this is Quentin, and have a nice day.